What's good guys, it's your man Harrison back again with another video. Today I'm gonna to be going through GBP USD and how your boy is trading it, so let's go. All right guys, so before we get into the video, make sure you smash that subscribe button. You guys know that your boy's on the road to 10,000 subscribers. The Liquidity Gang family is growing so much. So guys, if you're vibes in with the content, if you're liking it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Literally takes one or two seconds and it helps out the channel a whole lot. Also family, definitely like the video. Let's try and get this video to 300 likes. I know the gang is strong and I know you guys can do it. But other than that guys, let's get straight into the video. All right guys, so as you can see, this is GPUSD. I really wanna just talk about these two trades right now. There was a potential third trade that I did try to get some people involved in, but it, it did me dirty, it did me dirty. I will come to that later on. But guys, first of all, I wanna talk about this trade down here. This was a 50 minute time frame play. After the UK announced a coronavirus vaccine that was 90% accurate, the thing just flew off. It flew off, okay? But guys, don't forget, when it flies off like this, don't be that person that's jumping in on those highs. Obviously, if you're a scalper, you're a scalper you can jump in whenever you want but don't be that person who jumps in at these highs you know because you're panicking because you're gonna miss the trade guys don't do that be patient and wait to know that it's gonna come back down okay we trace and then you get your entry right so like I said this was a 50 minute time frame play so 50 minute time frame let's go to it real quick uh, where are we yeah down here 50 minute time frame play as you can see so this was that massive spike up as you can see massive spike up and then it retraced back down i know you can't see it but look this is the wick that that's the wick over here traced back down into this area down here which is exactly what i wanted took the buy and we rolled up to 1.3200 after the spike up okay and then it retraced i was telling the guys that g is going to go to 1.3200 and that's exactly where it went to as you can see 1.3200 i said it to the t right so that was the buy, it got to our targets, and that was good, that was Gucci, right? But guys, we can also take it the other way, okay? Because if our goal was 1.3200 for the massive big drop, right? This is what we're talking about right now. So let's go to the one minute time frame, and I'm gonna explain to you what exactly is happening on a one minute time frame, and how I tried to get the team involved in this as well, right? So first of all, we see that generation of liquidity. Guys, I show you this stuff all the time. You, you see that generation of liquidity, we see equal highs up here. The moment you get equal high, you know where people stop pluses are. Their stop plus is somewhere within this range. So retail traders are taught that once you see a double top, right, you should sell it. And sometimes they get a piece of the pie, sometimes they get a bit of moon from that as well and it's all good i want everybody to win right but majority of the times what i see i use these things as target points i use them as target points right and so i had an equal high i knew people stop this up here so when people are getting stopped out this is where your boy wants to enter in once it ran out the liquidity as you can see right it ran out the liquidity right with this move up it ran out the liquidity with that move up right this is now where you're, you should be jumping in with your cells right in this area down here so this is where i was entering in with my cells on up here okay and then all i wanted to see was the short term low that took out this liquidity so this low took out that liquidity this low took out this liquidity up here right so the short term low that took out the liquidity which is this one down here i wanted to see it broken as you can see it break off the low yeah it broke the low let it do its thing and when it came back down it came to produce a double bottom ding 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 guys you should know exactly what they're trying to do right now they're building up a case to go lower as you can see so equal lows they're building up a case to go lower they've taken the liquidity on the top end now they're going to go forth and start snatching liquidity on the bottom end which is what they're doing now so once price retrace back up yeah to a premium price this is where you should be entering in the market and then selling again right so now this is how your boy got done dirty a little bit right so obviously we're waiting for that retracement okay i'm really in but i'm trying to get the team in as well okay and me trying to be me being perfect i would have said 1.3200 yeah but i said 1.3199 9. i was just hoping that they will go for a pip close and then just reverse right all right guys so here's our trade ideas group and this is exactly where i tried to get the team in on the gbp usd sell you can see right here it says entry 1.3199 so that's this was me trying to be one pip beneath perfect right had a stop loss of 11 pips and then look later on down the line you can see down here i said missed by one pip and then it dropped 20 pips instant then i said the sell limit was still active but then we deleted it later on because it never ever came back to our sell limit so finally you can see look i tried to get the team in man i tried to get the team in and it just didn't work it came to 1.3198 and four pipettes guys Look, they're playing with your boy. Yeah, that could have been a second sweet entry. 
This move here would have been the quickest amount of money you've made, right? If this equal lows was the draw on price, as you can see, and it's smashed straight through it and it's just going. It's going, it's gonna beat all these lows, right? It's gonna beat all these lows as well. And so guys, look, it's gonna smash out all those lows. It's gonna smash out all these lows. And if you want, you could have scaled off when price gets down to here, okay? When price gets down to here, you can scale off or you can close out your whole position. That would have been a sweet move. The stop loss for this one, for this trade, would have roughly been about 10 or 11 pips if we got here, okay? 10 or 11 pips if we got here. That's, that would have been a stop loss. So a nice little small stop loss and he would have had a juicy risk to reward. So guys, I'm still in this trade at the moment. We're gonna wait and see whether it gets down to our area and technically i am targeting much lower than that but just for this video anyway for this video look there's liquidity beneath the slowdown here this should be our nice little target zone for gbp usd so guys i'll give you guys an update shortly all right guys so just to give you guys a quick update your boy added another position once it got into this area down here and i just want to see this thing plummet 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 i want to see this thing plummet all the way down right so even if it gets to this low this would be a nice point to scale off I want to see this come and take this right so it's technically you know it looks like a little higher low so it could trade even higher but if it does it will hit my stop profit and then we keep it moving we keep it moving all right guys so just to give you guys an update with gu gu we're moving nicely literally guys if you wanted to take tp at these lows you could do it you can scale up as you can see the things are moving okay i had two nice entries one at the top no i really wanted this entry down here okay this is the one i really wanted this would have been a potential third entry but guys take what the market gives you it gave me one entry up here and it's giving me another one over here so that's good so guys like i said once it gets down here you guys know we like to smash through these tps as well so once it gets down here this will be a nice point to take tp done trading come back the next day you're good you understand you're good we're gonna wait and see whether it actually gets down there i'm gonna move this trade here into profit now I just wait it out wait for this to hit tp and your boy is done all right guys so another update with gu so with gu i've now jumped in with my third position so once price pushed up into this zone over here okay this is where i jumped in stop loss above this book over here all right and so literally a stop loss of about 6.5 pips and then we're going to be targeting three one zero zero so one dot three one zero zero this is where price bounced off but look people who bought from here their stop loss is going to be beneath this area so this is why i'm targeting three one dot three one zero zero this is exactly why i'm targeting one dot three one zero zero targeting their stop losses so guys this one i'm swing trading this one i'm thinking about swing trading but this one's going to be a scalp ting so as you guys can see, look, it came and snatched this liquidity. I know there's more liquidity beneath, but this is more than enough to be consistently profitable every single day, guys. So I wanted to show you guys how your boy was trading GBP USD, where I'm actually taking my entries to. And as you can see, boom, it's come down to snatch this TP. This would have been where you would have scaled off the majority of your position and then you could have let the rest ride if you wanted to or just closed off and you're nice for the day. Let's go. Thank you guys for watching the video. Like I said, guys, if you want mentorship, hit me up on Instagram. Just type in mentorship and we can get to work with you. Also, remember, guys, we're on the road to 10,000 subscribers. So, guys, if you can go ahead and subscribe to the channel, let's get your boy to 10K. It will be absolutely crazy. But I know we're going to be aiming for 50K, then 100K, guys. Literally, it's going to be absolutely crazy. Join the family. Let's get to 10K strong. Also, guys, smash that thumbs up button. Let's try and get 300 likes on this video. Let's go.